Hello everyone, it's George here and today I'm going to be actually doing something a little different. I'm going to be showing you how to work through Illustrator and how to use the pen tool to create certain shapes. So today I have a helmet that I found from Google that I'm going to use the pen tool to replicate the shape. So I like to start on the curve. Let me turn my fill off just so things are a little more transparent. We're just going to click and drag until we get that curve the way we like it here. I'm going to take it all the way down to the bottom of the helmet. Oops. I'm going to fill it with a black boom. We have our helmet shape. We're going to go in and add a few details to this helmet. I'm going to start by taking this path and moving it under our image here. Just so I can keep working and see what I'm actually doing. I'm going to zoom in. Once again, I'm going to press P for the pen tool and start creating this visor. So you can just click and drag until your curve matches the curve you're trying to create. Let me turn my fill off. And honestly, if you're doing this right, a lot of the time your curves will just match. We're going to actually go ahead and fill that now with a lighter gray color. I'm going to turn the opacity down on that to give it a somewhat transparent look. Show you what that's looking like with the other shape. As you can see, it's looking pretty close to what we had from the stock image. Next, I'm going to add in a few more details. Let's start by adding in this mirror side or this uh, visor contraption here.
fill that shape with a lighter black. I'm going to go in here and do a little bit of fine tuning with the direct selection tool. Get this tool by pressing A. that little bit of black showing there that I'm not too happy with. Just cover that. slight stroke to this actually I'm going to take the stroke off of this one so if I were to take these shapes here and merge them Now we would have one solid shape. Oops, need to grab the actual group. And I can do what I want to with it here. Make it big. I can rotate it. compare it. get a lot more in depth but for the sake of this tutorial we're going to keep it pretty short and quick but that's a quick pin tutorial in Adobe Illustrator hope you enjoy